welcome to the University of New England's Life Cycle of Grant Funding course. Before I introduce myself, I would like to tell you just a little bit about this course and what makes it unique. This course was not designed to duplicate the many excellent grant writing courses, books, and resources available to you, but rather it was designed to be a practical experiential course. So as a student, you will go through the full life cycle of grant funding, developing material that aligns with your organization's mission. Or if you're not currently working for an organization that seeks grant funding, you will develop work that aligns with the mission of an organization you could envision yourself working with. This will include developing fundable ideas, identifying funders that align with your mission, the full process of writing the grant proposal, and most importantly, developing and sustaining relationships with funders. When you finish this course, you will have a ready to or nearly ready to submit proposal, ready to go to a funder whose goals align with your organizational goals. The focus of this course is on funding from foundation grants. Much of what we cover can be applied to government agency grants. The details involved in getting funding from those agencies is not covered in this course. This course was designed for people who work for or intend to work for small organizations that rely on funds from foundation grants to achieve their goals and missions. That is why I was excited to have the opportunity to help develop this course. My name is Dr. Beth Falls, and I've been working for the types of organizations I just described since 1999. Over the years, I have learned by necessity how to successfully develop relationships with funders and obtain the grant funding I need to support my programs and projects. I have been mentoring early career staff at my organization for some time now, sharing with them the things that I have learned about grant funding over the years. And that is what I put into this course. I hope that you enjoy it.